Welcome, welcome back at I need help at C squared. In this example, we have to sketch the graph of a hyperbola by hand. First of all, what you really want to find out is the center of this hyperbola, which is going to be negative 3. Right, we see x plus 3, so that will be x minus negative 3 and positive 1. Okay, so on an x and y axis, I'm going to plot that center, negative 3 and 1. That means go 3 left, 1 up. That's the center. And now the next thing I, I, I know we need to take a look is the form of this hyperbola, which is like an x squared minus a y squared, x plus 3 squared uh, over 16 minus y minus 1 squared over 4. So that should tell us that y equals 1, All right? You notice this guy is the uh, focal axis. On this line, on this dashed line, we have the forces. So how do we find the forces? Now we're going to look to this 16, which is a squared. And we're going to need to find a, which is going to be plus or minus square root of 16. So that will be plus or minus 4, which means that we're going to need to go 4 units left and 4 units right on this focal axis to get the vertices. So if this is a negative, this, this center is negative 3 and 1 and I go 4 left, this point is going to be negative 7 and 1. And if I go from negative 3 and 1, uh, 4 units, right? That means that point will be 1 and 1. And we have the two vertices. And the next thing you really want to find out is the asymptotes for these uh, hyperbolas. For that reason, we're going to need to find b, and b squared is 4, so b will be square root of 4 plus or minus, and that will be 2. And now we can write the equation of the asymptotes, which are y minus k, y minus 1 equals plus or minus b over a 2 over 4 x minus h and x plus 3. You need to sketch these two lines and then you can have a good and accurate graph. Since I do not have graph paper, I'm going to just do the, the uh, uh, hyperbolas here. Okay, you see the same thing down here, uh, the summary of what I did. And also you can see the equation of the asymptote that I just wrote. And the, this is the exact graph I uh, sketch it down here. And that's it. If you enjoyed this video clip, don't forget to click the like button and come back on C-square for more help. Thank you.